In this video, you'll learn the part marking feature that enables you to engrave on the finished aligners. Before using this feature, you need to attach a fixture to your models. It will ensure that they will be put into the engraving machine in the correct position and that there will be no errors when marking the aligners. It's important to know where the starting point of the coordinate system is for both the model and the fixture. This knowledge can be used when adding your own fixtures in Ortho Control Panel. In Ortho Control Panel, go to Milling Machine Fixtures and press Add. Fill in an individual ID that this fixture will have in your Ortho software. In order to import a fixture, press the red X button and a window will pop up. Find the specific fixture file that you want to import and press Open. Please bear in mind that if you want the fixture geometry to be subtractive, you must enable the Subtract Fixture from Model option. When finished, press Save and exit the control panel. The software allows you to attach a fixture during model preparation in the sculpt step for both the maxillary and the mandibular jaw. Press Fixture and select one from the drop-down list. Use the control points to move and rotate it. Press Apply. It's good to know that fixtures can also be mixed to create more complicated shapes. When in the Export window, you can edit all the settings for part marking. To be able to do that, you must make sure that the Marking Tag Simulation option is enabled. To put graphic markings, you need to enable the Graphics Marking Tag Simulation option as well. It may prove helpful to open the drawers to have a better overview of the model. The software enables you to adjust the tag. Click the plus button to select a text from the drop-down list. It's worth remembering that the red text elements like Sub Setup Number will automatically change for each aligner. You can also add your own custom text. It is possible to choose the text font and its size. The software offers you a selection of all the fonts installed on your operating system. Use the blue arrows to correct the position and set which tooth the text should start from. You are able to select if this correction should apply to a specific jaw or both. You can also select if the tag should appear only on a specific jaw or both. In the Graphics Marking Tag Simulation, you can define a specific field inside of which a graphic can be engraved by the machine. Once you are satisfied with the part marking settings, press Export. The generated files will contain all the data needed by the engraving equipment to put the markings on the aligners correctly. We hope this was helpful and thank you for watching.